First you inspired dozens, then you inspired hundreds, then you inspired thousands, then tens of thousands, then hundreds of thousands, and now the unbelievable number. Christians United for Israel now number one million supporters. Congratulations, Pastor Hege, for this remarkable achievement. I should talk to you more often. <laughs> and I know this is only the beginning because there's a dramatic transformation that's taking place in the relationship between Christians and Jews. And for centuries, this relationship was focused on our differences and a, a tortured past. But today, thanks to leaders like you, Jews and Christians are focusing on the common future that we have and the common values that we share. Now you look around the, the shifting sands of this turbulent, windswept Middle East, and it's clear that these shared values that we have set Israel apart. Values that ensure that Israel's government will never tolerate discrimination against women. And values that assure that Israel's Christian population will always be free to practice their faith. That's the only place in the Middle East where Christians are fully free to practice their faith. They don't have to fear. They don't have to flee. At a time when Christians are under siege in so many places, in so many lands in the Middle East, I'm proud that in Israel, Christians are free to practice their faith and to have a thriving Christian community in Israel.